in Britain, the magician Paul Daniels has died aged 77 just a few weeks after it was announced that he had been diagnosed with a brain tumour. The TV star left hospital 10 days ago in order to spend his final days at home with his family. But it is in truth only a steel circle on this side. You see, can you see that? Yeah. And on the other side, it's a square. <laughs> it's a silly little trick. He was, during the 80s and 90s, one of the biggest stars on British TV. He's the man who with up to 15 million viewers tuning into his show every week. Paul Daniels was also a regular on Irish programmes, his quick hands matched by his quick wit. Okay, I'm you take one man. of those top, bottom, middle, anywhere, right, got it. get it out. Have you got it? Yeah, got it. Right, look at it, five yeah. of hearts, it saves time. Right. <laughs> he was also known for a string of catchphrases, which he said were honed during the early days of dealing with hecklers in small clubs. And I said, oh, I like yours. Not a lot, but I like it. <laughs> He was respected by other magicians too, inspiring a new generation. He was probably the first introduction that many people had to magic, especially in, in England and the UK. Um, everyone I know had a Paul Daniels magic kit. More recently though, Paul Daniels attracted some criticism over remarks he made at the height of the Jimmy Savile abuse scandal. In 1988, he married his stage assistant, Debbie McGee. It caused somewhat of a stir. But what first, Debbie, attracted you to the millionaire Paul Daniels? <laughs> but the couple went on to have what's being described as one of the more enduring partnerships in show business, both on and off stage.